Hello Celtic supporter, welcome to the Celtic News Channel. If you love this club with all your heart, hit the like button. Here, I bring you the latest updates about our beloved club. And today, I have extremely important news for the loyal Celtic supporters regarding the transfer market. Speaking of loyal supporters, I want to invite you to subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications because I bring you the latest Celtic updates every day. Today, we have news that might warm the green and white hearts, as it seems that a beloved player is thinking about coming back home. Hotter, the player who left Parkhead this summer, appears to have experienced a true nightmare since his million-dollar move to the Saudi Pro League champions. After winning a treble with the hoops, he made a big-money transfer to join stars like Karim Benzema and N'Golo Kante at al -Itihad. However, he now faces the prospect of being left out of the squad for the upcoming season. With Saudi rules allowing only eight foreign players to be registered each season, Hotter seems set to sit out, at least until January when the transfer window opens again. The arrival of Luis Felipe increased the number of foreign players to nine, and there are rumors that either Hotter or goalkeeper Marcelo Gro might be excluded from the list when it's revealed on September 15. In an interview on the Saudi TV program Action YA Dori, Hamd Al-Balawi of Itihad suggested that Hotter had considered a loan return to Celtic before the Scottish transfer window closed. However, a move to the UAE Pro League or the Turkish giants Fenerbahce seems more likely, as those transfer windows remain open. Al-Balawi urged Itihad to offload the winger instead of their starting goalkeeper, stating, release a foreign player who doesn't participate, like Hotter, and if the coach is reluctant to release him, he can choose another name besides Gro. But I believe that if the coach was convinced of the player, he would have continued to field him. Hotter was left out of Itihad's squad for the match against a lockdown on Thursday, with coach Nuno claiming the player was injured and avoiding commenting on his exclusion. Since Hotter's departure, Brendan Rodgers has bolstered his wing options with players like Young and Marco Tilio, while Leo Labada faces an injury that will keep him out for up to four months. Well, green and white supporter, what do you think of this news? It's always important for you to comment so that Celtic knows what its fans are thinking, and of course, if you made it this far. Don't forget to leave a like to motivate me to bring more news from Glasgow Celtic. Thank you.